finally got a freaking spot. Now I gotta catch bait. Hope they can catch some bait and slide out. Be? No way! Guys, there's a freaking moy! Oh shit! Yeah! <laughs> a freaking moy, guys! Yeah, you! Oh! Nice! 
Something else. That could be big. Slide bait. Slide bait right now. Oh. All right, so this method right here is called sliding bait. I'm bringing my pole down, uh, placing it down nicely there. This slide goes on top of the main line and it's made to slide down to your stopper, your stopper ring. Uh, this method is called slide B. Uh, in a second, I'm gonna let it loose and let it slide down the main line. You see it there? Bye bye, Mr. Kofibi. So, uh, yeah, it goes down to your stopper ring. Your stopper ring is rigged to your lead line just above the reef that's exactly where it wants to be down, not on the rocks right in that little zone where predator fish can see it and try and get it another good tip right here i have my paracord i use one looped end to wrap around a lava rock or some kind of good base and the other end i tie it to my pole just for extra security that uh, in case something big bites and my pole really goes down you don't want that flying in the water so always secure your fishing pole that is very important and my line got loose
hawkfish, rockfish, also known as. Get this bugger back. Hello. I don't have a bell, so I gotta pay attention to that thing. Oh, I got something. <laughs> Those in Kupipi. Holy oh, cow. You know what? I never did eat Kupipi. But this one looks pretty meaty and looking forward to bring some fish home. Oh, crap. It's feisty. And he crapped all over me just now. Just leave him there for now. Then I'm back. You know how to act. Trying to conserve some bait because I'm limited and it's turning out very well. Check it out again. Nibbles. Oh, great. Swallow that thing. Something good. We got something good right here. No weave right now. Ah, he came off. Fuck. Fuck. Get out of here. 
Oh shit. Came off. Something good. Damn. Damn it. Came off. Come on. None of that. And it's a four far. <laughs> oh boy. Alright, well that was fun. I'm gonna pack it up folks. If you guys enjoyed the video. Like and subscribe, baby. I got my beat back. Okay, one more cast. <laughs> Got my big back. Awesome. One more cast out there. Let's go. Something has it already. Another faux pas. <laughs> yup. Yeah. Today's catch and came home, clean them up. I said, "Hun, you have some poo poos." She goes, "Yeah, shoots." So I pop myself a drink. Cheers. So I get my oil. We're gonna do the little uh, peanut oil trick on top of the fish again. A lot of guys like that. So you know what? Like I said, I'm gonna put out more content. So there's a catch and cook, but you know. It took me like 45 minutes just to find myself a spot to it. The beaches are packed. It's like there's no COVID-19 happening or something. I don't know what was it, but. All right, sorry about that. Um, like I was saying, it took me 45 minutes just to get my fishing spot today. It was ridiculous. Every spot that I went, loaded with people. That is a timer. 
and stop it. Um, loaded with people, the beach is loaded. Went down four miles, turned around, went to Honolulu, thought about fishing there for a bit, and I was like, ah, nah. Went back to four miles, found a spot, went there, and I caught some fish. This is what I have for you guys today. Mommy, Daddy, look at this sticker. Oh, you put stickers all in your bus. Awesome. Awesome. <laughs> this is what I got, guys. Oh, bruh. Something messed up. My GoPro died on me. So I'm filming it one hand. The oil's done. Okay, hold on. Let's to the fork and to the nose. Eleven inches. <laughs> I just made them. I just made them for the season. And these two were actually my slide baits. All right, I'm gonna try to do this set. <coughs> One hand. Got it right in my chest. Here it is, guys. This is Moy, this is what? Cookie peas. On the third too? Mm hmm They're actually my slide baits out there. <laughs> but um I never wanted to waste them, so. Cookie peas pretty meaty too. It's the moy. Mmm. Delicious, huh? Yeah. But gotta watch out for the bones. It looks like it has Was it basil I put in there? Mm -hmm. The the shaker one? Mm-hmm. Yeah, so there's basil. We put basil, this one has uh, a garlic, salt, and black pepper. Crisped with the oil. You want a bigger piece than that? Yeah, because the, <laughs> the hell was that? <laughs> I was trying to get you a piece where there's no like... Here, you chopped the bones though. Wow. That's a really good fish. <laughs> oh god. So moist season is closed from June through August. And as you guys saw on my video, I caught this moy. And again, I was trying to catch bait fish, like the kupipis. Then this bugger comes around, first one to catch. Was a freaking moy, and this is the second one I ever caught in my whole life. 
But what's the sizes um, you can The size limit is 11 and up. Exactly. This one just made it. So I'm happy with that. Look, we get grinds. Good stuff, man. <laughs> Yummy. Mahalo. Mahalo. And thanks for watching, guys. Stick around for more uh, fishing videos, hopefully. Yeah, boss? Yeah. <laughs> and um, hopefully more catching cooks as well, because this is pretty fun. Catching what I caught. Catching what I caught. Cooking what I caught. Comment down below <laughs> if you want to see, if you want me to let him go fish more. Nah. Comment down below if you guys want her to let me go fish. <laughs> the more comments, the more likes, the more chances I have of going fishing, guys. Help me out. <laughs> Alright, so this moy. This moy. Back in the old Hawaiian days, it was a delicacy and only meant for the kings to eat. Nobody else could eat them. So that's a fun fact. But, but in these modern days, in these modern days, we just have open and closed seasons. You can grind them. I know in Florida, they catch them like crazy. Um, and they just throw it back, but they don't really know how good it tastes. <clears throat> so what happens to like back in the day if people were like if you weren't a king and you were eat, like you just eat this good question hon do they get prosecuted for that they grab their testicles no and they chop it off <laughs> <laughs> like how would they know anyway how they know yeah how would they know they wouldn't they know. smell your bread oh, they if wouldn't your bread smell like fish especially like, this fish they cut your balls off if it was me i would just <laughs> hide and eat them you know what i mean Shame! Shame! <laughs> <Nobody>. Shame! <laughs> Nobody would know, right? The little Leanne in the bushes bugging. Oh my god, I had a skill on my freaking hand. <laughs> oh man. Can you not point me? Come oh, look at her, guys. Oh, she's my queen. And I'm the king. And we're sharing this fish. <laughs> Wait. Is it good? Make Same. sure there's no bones. Is it yummy? I make sure I eat that piece. Good? <laughs> what is that? What is this? What's this? Crocodile. <laughs> <laughs> he, think, he thinks it's a crocodile. Why? Tree and then is he on the crocodile? I guess because the bones, just show the bones. He thinks it's a crocodile because this. Look at crocodiles, this. That's not a crocodile, son. What color? What color? White. Okay, but it's not a crocodile. Mmm. Some more? Some more. Oh my goodness. <laughs> That's my boy. All right. Say bye. Bye. Zane. I'm a say mess. Bye. I don't even know why you put me in there. The house is a mess too. Oh, I. Anyway. Shoots, guys. Love you all. Bye. Hello. Hello, you there?